Hello and welcome to all. White animals have such an unusual appearance that they have always been considered special. And this is not surprising because such animals are very rare in nature. The reason is that their white color is caused either by albinism or leucism, diseases that affect very few individuals. So if you have never seen a dolphin, an alligator or a peacock that is completely white, keep your eyes wide open because you will be amazed when you discover these animals. Are you ready? So, these are the most beautiful white animals. Originally from India, the peacock, with its royal appearance, is considered by some to be the most beautiful bird in the world. It is true that this majestic animal with blue and gold feathers is breathtakingly beautiful. However, while peacocks are known for their colorful wheel with shimmering reflections, there is another species of peacock that has preferred to opt for immaculate white. This is the white peacock. These wonderful birds actually have all white feathers. This gives them a fascinating appearance. Just like the other species, the male white peacock has long tail feathers, which allow it to do a wheel and thus impress the females. It is not only female peacocks that are impressed, humans also marvel at its majestic wheel. However, if the peacock can be white it is for a reason. Contrary to popular belief, the white peacock is not albino. Indeed, an albino animal is white and has red eyes. And this is not the case with the white peacock. The white peacock has actually undergone a genetic mutation called leucism, which causes a total absence of pigment in the plumage but does not affect the color of the eyes. Not surprisingly, this phenomenon is very rare. Therefore, it is unfortunately much more complicated to cross the path of a white peacock. On the American coasts, tourists initially come to watch whales, but from time to time they have the pleasant surprise of seeing a much more fascinating animal. Indeed, on the surface of California waters a magnificent creature has been spotted several times. It was a Rissos dolphin. But not just any dolphin. This dolphin was clearly differentiated from other members of its species by its color. The reason? Well, this little Rissos dolphin has an all-white body. Usually these dolphin species have dark skin and are characterized by the presence of several scars. But that is clearly not the case with this dolphin. Most likely albino, the milky-skinned animal still impresses today with its unique beauty. Unfortunately, albinism is not without danger for this exceptional dolphin. This genetic disease not only makes the dolphin more visible to predators, but also causes several health complications, such as visual impairment and extreme sensitivity to sunlight, among others. The presence of this visibly healthy young dolphin therefore delights spectators and scientists alike, confirming that it has managed to survive for several years. Lucky are the Californians who have in any case been able to discover this rare animal. The giraffe, it is well known, is a mammal with long legs, a long neck and a coat recognizable by its red spots on a white background. But did you know that there are completely white giraffes? Yet these extremely rare specimens have indeed been observed by researchers in Kenya. Their images soon caused a worldwide sensation. We can see an adult giraffe pacing a few meters away from its giraffe, as if to warn it of possible predation. However, although the giraffe appears to be dressed all in white, uniformly, some traces and discoloration are still visible on the giraffe's coat. The reason is that, according to specialists, these white giraffes have the characteristics of a genetic condition known as leucism. Later, the giraffe had another young, also snow white. A true wonder of nature. Unfortunately, these giraffes, which fascinated so much in 2017, could not live very long. In March 2020, the only white giraffe and its giraffe were found dead, killed by poachers. There is now only one white giraffe left in the world, a male. This tragic announcement was a hard blow not only for the associations working for their protection but also for the whole world. Here's Albi now. A green turtle, all white. A very rare case of albinism in this species of sea turtle. Albi was discovered on Castaways Beach in Eastern Australia in February 2015 by volunteers from an association who had come to collect data on newly hatched green turtle eggs. It was therefore by chance that this small albino reptile was filmed, just like its 122 brothers and sisters who left their nest buried under the sand to reach the ocean. Normally, the babies crossing the beach have to face the predators that come in large numbers, and only part of the brood will have the chance to explore the immensity of the oceans. Indeed, only one turtle in 1000 manages to reach adulthood on average. 
But for this all-white turtle the task was probably less difficult since its color blends very well with the sand, making it almost invisible to predators. After setting out to sea, Albi naturally disappeared into the wild. However, the images of this white turtle could be shared a multitude of times in all social networks, making Albi one of the most famous turtles in the world. Before we continue this video, here's the question of the day. Which plant is capable of surviving albinism on a sustainable basis? Option A. Redwood. Option B. The Lesser Celandine. Option C. Maceron. Write the right answer in the comments and we'll see at the end of the video if you were right. Snowflake is the name of the most fascinating gorilla in the whole world. Captured in 1966 by villagers from Western Guinea, Snowflake lived in the Barcelona Zoological Park and very quickly attracted attention thanks to its quite exceptional particularity. This gorilla is, as its name suggests, very white. Which is, at least, very rare. Moreover, this western lowland gorilla is recognized as the only albino specimen identified so far. The origin of its lack of pigmentation has remained a mystery for years, but it is now becoming clearer as Spanish researchers have completed the sequencing of the primate genome using frozen blood samples. The results of their work have revealed not only the mutation responsible for such a trait, but also the genealogy of snowflake. The animal would thus be the result of inbreeding, i.e. its parents belong to the same family. The latter possessed the genes responsible for albinism, and the snowflake gorilla inherited them. Over the years, this white gorilla became the main attraction of the zoo and the city's mascot. But in 2003, Snowflake died of skin cancer, probably due to albinism associated with exposure to the sun's UV rays. Since then, several works of fiction have told the story of his life or portrayed him in various ways. Snakes have the reputation of being very dangerous reptiles. And that's not wrong, most species of snakes are not very hospitable if you find yourself in their territory. However, there are species of snakes that can also be very beautiful. The proof with these albino snakes. They have a completely white color, which gives them the appearance of harmless little creatures, but unfortunately this is not the case at all. And yes, although this white color gives them an attractive look, it would be better to contemplate the animal from a distance. Furthermore, when white snakes are not living in captivity, their risk of surviving permanently in the wild may be low for some species. Indeed, snakes manage to capture their prey mainly thanks to their discretion, and especially to their skin color, which blends particularly well with their natural environment. Therefore, because of their white color, albino snakes are highly visible and will not easily catch their prey. Nevertheless, it must be admitted that these snakes are surprisingly beautiful. It is not without reason that they have been the source of many tales for centuries. There are many horses that have a perfectly white coat. Their beauty is even legendary. However, these so-called white horses are actually gray horses. Indeed, gray horses have a white coat but black skin around the eyes and nose. Nevertheless, this does not mean that white horses do not exist. The latter, although very rare, have been seen several times throughout history. But what is the difference between white and gray horses, would you say? Well, it's simple. The white horse will have pink skin without any markings, a uniformly white coat, light hooves, blue or dark eyes, and above all it will not change color with age. Moreover, the white coat may appear spontaneously in a foal from a population of normally colored horses. However, there is a reason why horses are so white. Geneticists, especially American ones, suggest that the origin of the white coat in horses is caused by the gene called W, for, white, or, blanc, in French. Unsurprisingly, the beauty of the white horse and its elegance have been the source of myths, legends, tales and rituals in many cultures. After all, the white horse is truly extraordinary. Now here's an alligator that certainly won't go unnoticed. Entirely white in color, this alligator is an extremely rare animal since just one in more than two and a half million individuals born. This exceptional color is caused by albinism or leucism. Their skin is very pale due to the absence of melanin and the iris is blue or even pink. Unfortunately, the life expectancy of these beautiful creatures in the wild is limited to 24 hours. The main reason is that the sun causes severe burns to the white alligators. In addition, their poor eyesight and the depigmentation of their skin make them easy prey. 
This is why most white alligators that have reached adulthood nowadays live in captivity. However, a few years ago, researchers came across an all-white alligator living in the wild. Named Pearl, this alligator was found in Darwin, Australia. Three meters long, this female has clearly managed to survive in her environment. Scientists were surprised by this. At least for the moment, Pearl seems to be in very good health. And we must admit that the beauty of this alligator is unique. Now it's your turn to tell us which of these animals is, in your opinion, the most beautiful? If not, plants can also be affected by albinism. In this case, albinism is not an absence of melanin, but of chlorophyll, the green pigment. Unfortunately, these plants do not live long. But the redwood has found a good way to survive. All it has to do is pump sap from another tree like a vampire. So, it's the redwood that is able to survive long despite albinism. I hope that many of you have found the right answer.